Hello and welcome back to Mikey's Flytech. Today I will show you how you can make this transition for your Boeing side wall and prepare it for painting. I worked with paper templates of every piece, which helped estimating the different shapes and let me test the fitting. Chamfering all edges will give the parts a better fitting and supports the gluing. Don't try to be too accurate when you're cutting this piece here. Just make sure that the MDF doesn't reach over this edge here. And if there are any gaps here, you can fill them with some small pieces of MDF or some putty later. The nails need to be long to guarantee a good fixation of all the angled pieces. You can cut away the waste later. Some days ago I read a discussion about my channel on a French website and they said that I'm nailing so much. I don't know what they mean. As I said before, don't be too accurate. All gaps will be filled later. This front piece is supported by an angled bar of wood to get some material for the nailing. The same wooden support technique was applied to some other parts.
I extended the side wall to the outer post to close this gap. And then I started a long sanding and filling session. Then it was time to fill all gaps and round the inside edges. I used some power tools to get a basic rounding of the edges, but most of the sanding is dirty handwork. And here it is, prepared for painting. There is one part still missing, and this is this part here. If you follow the sidewall construction plan, this is part 11. And I've done this because it would be very difficult to finish these areas behind this part here. So I leave it away for now, paint this area and then screw it back in place, finish the edges around it and paint the whole sidewall. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like my site on Facebook to inform your friends about this project and if you are new to this channel then subscribe to it to stay informed about any upcoming new video from me. So I hope we will see us soon back on the flight deck.